Now real quick, for those of you who don't want to do a, a huge mail merge for envelopes, like you have 30 or 50, but you want to print off one or two envelopes, you don't want to handwrite it because it looks cleaner, maybe more professional, unless you've got this really great looking handwriting here. But to get started, just click on the mailings tab here, and then over here in the create group, click on envelopes. And that just gives you a field to uh, type in who it's to and your return address, and then you know, click print, it prints it off for you. In fact, if you have Microsoft Outlook here, you can click on the book, and it automatically will go to your contacts here. Or if it doesn't, um, you can just click OK, and it will bring you to the contacts. And I've got Homer Simpson. I can go ahead and select him or Wilberforce and click OK. Of course, I don't have his address in the contacts, but that means I need to go back and, up and insert his address, but I can continue here. So there's who it's addressed to, and then down here I can say, once I'm done, I, I can just go ahead and click print, and it will print. And you can see in the preview here, it's going to print the delivery address right here, and then the upper left-hand corner is going to be my return address. I'm not going to click print right now, because it's actually going to print it. When I click print, it'll say, do you want this return address to be your default address? That way you don't have to keep typing it in over and over again. The only thing you probably want to concern yourself is the feed option. And you can see a little preview right there of how you're going to feed it. Is it going to be face up? Or you can click on it and say it's going to be face up, but it's going to be fed into the printer in the right hand corner or the left hand corner. You go ahead and pick and choose and whether it's going to be face up or face down. And then of course if you're just doing a single label, hey, just click on the labels here. You can do the full page of the same label, very easy. Or you can just do a single label, one row, one column, and then click print. Thanks for watching. Hey, as a quick reminder, if you like my video, please give it a thumbs up. You can also click on me and subscribe to my channel, get notified of the latest videos, and for only $2 a month, you can have access to all my Microsoft Office training videos.